Yeah, we have a good training week again. We have a plan. I hope we can implement the plan in the in the game. And when we do this, then we have a good chance we can win the game. I think the, the players was not in, in the squad or in the start 11. They wait of the chance and now they have the chance. We have the quality. We have a, a big squad and we have a big quality in the whole squad. All, all guys want to play in the moment and it, I'm, I'm happy about this. And I hope they bring the, the performance in the game today and then uh, we have a big chance we can win the game. Another top-notch Netfan Cup lost 32 clash between former champion Simmers at the Orlando Stadium where the second best ever performers, Orlando Pirates, square off against the Pitvest Vets who post the sixth best record in the tournament. On that note, a very good afternoon it is to you wherever you may be on our beautiful continent as we get closer and closer to kickoff for the home support. Well, they would have had to wait now since 2014, since the last time Pirates had the winning of the Netbank Cup. They are eight-time winners of this tournament. Only one side has done better. Whilst for Pitless Vest, they lost won it in 2010. The only time they've uh, won it outside of that was back in the 70s. Sekota gets to the byline here and looks to drill it in. Low and hard towards the near post. Domingo picking up the pieces. Appealing for the penalty given by Victor Gauche. Right next to the action, wasted little time in making his decision. Now, here's Ivanka, looking for his first, gets it! Puts Splitless Fliss into the lead. The pass That's what he's about. Better. To win the ball up against those type of players. Hato, strong! Hato! Makes it jump! Whoa! Dion Hato, too strong for Dovu. Memela, good ball, Richards! Goss gets a bit of a touch, but there is no denying Orlando Paris. It's Lodge, brings it back to within one, and plenty of time to find another. Couple of great defensive plays. Hello!
Save Orlando Pirates the advantage in the penalty shootout. Janet off the underside of the bar. No goalkeeper in the world for the same dance. In off the bench to make a difference. How big a difference? A huge difference. Keeps a minute. One on the scoreline here. Flip pass up against Goss. Set on and denied by Goss. Not only does he get right, but he gets a good strong hand onto it. We all said, but uh, you know, uh, we can take something from this game. You know, uh, I'm happy as a team we, we fought, we came back, and uh, yeah, it's penalties, anyone can win. So uh, it's just that it was in our day. We, we wanted to, to to go to the next round, you know, uh, and we knew that the, the only way to get there is to play the football that we know. And uh, the guys were pushing each other, which is, was good, you know, and we pushed each other. And yeah, we, we scored uh, the first, second and the third goal in, in extra time. But yeah, it's football unlucky, lack of concentration, considered a, a, a goal and uh, went to penalties and uh, we lost. Uh, for me, I think it's uh, um, the guys, you know, we had confidence. Everyone knows uh, uh, where to kick the penalty. And you, I could see everyone kick where you normally kick penalty training. But uh, I guess it was, it was not our day and, you know, penalties gambling. The boys uh, did very well to get the results, but uh, the first uh, 20 minutes we started very slowly until we adjusted. And once we started to score the first goal and then it was more open because they had to come and uh, try to find an equalizer. Remember we are behind them so we needed to get the three point which is more necessary for us. Losing uh, Bonsil Mbangwa, it had to change our tactical plan because we were playing with two uh, a defensive midfield and then we had to uh, reinforce it now to play with one and then play with two tens, which was not the game plan for the day. But uh, at the end, at least the boys, they managed to come through with the results. It's a much concern because uh, the, at the time when they, we started to concede, we see the boys now, they were getting tired and they opened more centrally, which we said that we must close the central part and force them outside. But uh, due to lack of concentration and then the boys managed to open inside and we were punished from that side. We're still uh, sitting position three, but at least it, it, it enhanced our chances uh, that we left with seven games to go. Uh, we sure that uh, at the end we might uh, reach the second position or if not the first.
Yeah, we are here because right now, Ses Kaina Maris has double legally three points. You see, he's a center with the good race, the league. Oh, yes, not our cool because like we close the gap because we vets, he pit vets number two, which is like we close the gap. So, so I think they are leading us on four points now, which is it's possible to win the league. <laughs> For more videos like this one, download the Orlando Pirates app now. Subscribe.